Welcome to this tutorial. In this lesson, we will learn how to fill a bathtub with water and make an animation. This uh, water simulation will be achieved using Chaos Phoenix FD in 3ds Max and V-Ray. I'll hide the rest of the objects in the scene. First, you must have installed the Phoenix plugin from the Chaos website. Let me begin by working on my faucet. Create the liquid simulator box. Increase height to reach the extent of our faucet. Select the inner portion of the faucet. Go to the edit poly, make a selection, detach and name it. This object determines the source of our water flow. Click on the Phoenix liquid source option and create its icon in the viewport. In the settings section, we'll add the object that we created as an emitter node. Object still selected, right click and select convert to editable poly. Assign a polygon material ID. This same number we will insert in our liquid source option settings under polygon ID slot. Under the particle preview section, turn on the show mesh option. Click on start simulation to create a water simulation. angle the lever handle now we can refine the simulation settings further click on the increase resolution so be careful because this will slow down your machine. Under Dynamics, 
add the steps per frame to 4. By refining the settings, the flow of the water becomes smoother, as you can see. Another setting half the time scale to 0.5. Now we want to fill up our bathtub with water. Select initial fill up percentage, reduce it to 10. As you can see, the challenge we are facing now is that, the, is that the water volume is not confined within the boundaries of the bathtub. How do we solve this, you ask? What we need to do is this. Select the inner polygons of the bathtub. Detach it as a clone. Name it for ease of reference. Cap the holes to avoid issues arising from the polygon itself. Select all the polygons, select flip option to reverse the normal direction of all the polygons. Go to the Chaos Phoenix Properties section and click on Initial Liquid Fill option. Let's start the simulation to see what we have now. The water is now limited to the inside of the bathtub. To create animation preview, click on the plus sign, create preview, create preview animation, here I'll adjust a few settings, preview preset, standard, image quality 100 and check these three items, we do not need them for now, then click on create. Our water is not visible and it's because of the object that we created. To hide it, right click on the object, click on display as box and then check the renderable option. Let's create another animation preview.
looks okay so thanks for watching this video tutorial as always please thumbs up the video it really helps subscribe and let me know in the comments section if you have any questions or suggestions or which areas you need clarification on